Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back for more Shante and Genie Hero. We got the map. Gotta get to the magic carpet race, I'll explain. There's no time to waste. Also, since we get the elephant stomp, there's uh, something else we can do in Main Street. But it's not super important. And we can do that later. So we're gonna go here. Cool. It's not super important. Sure, we can save our game. <laughs> Somebody please tell me what this is all about. Why is Bolo here? There's some mysterious man. Oh, the mystery man told us about some heist. Someone's after the magic carpets. We need Sky and Bolo to watch from the stands. And Roddy will be our pit crew. Alright. Bro, let's do it, people. Good luck, everyone. So now, we are, we are in the race. We're in the race. I hope you're ready for uh, platforming, because you, you don't have a lot of time. Let's go. We're on this carpet, man. Alright, now for this magic carpet segment, it's pretty much Owl Scroller. Um, there are two ways you can really go about it. There are two, two trophies associated with uh, this uh, segment here. You can uh, go through and hit um, every contestant, so if you hit somebody, they just fall off the carpet and, uh, you know, fly back. You can hit these guys, too. Uh, if you hit everybody and take them all out, it's a trophy for that. And then there's a trophy for not hitting, or not really for not hitting anyone, but for uh, not falling off. So if you fall off, I mean, I'll probably fall off on that last jump. So I've already forgotten how to, uh, how to not, not do it. How to not fuck up. But if you fall off, you just come back. You like hit the ground or hit the air, I guess, and then you just shoot back up. So I mean, nothing, nothing's lost. It's just honestly, if you just want the trophy. Just keep jumping on carpets. I mean, that's basically it. No, no, like items or anything here. These these sections here, they're not that mean. Um, it's just platforming. Alright, so we didn't fall off, cool. Um, that last um, jump onto the carpet, um, like if you jump, as soon as you land on like the next to last guy, you're, you're not going to make it, you're just going to fall off, and I do it every time, but I remember this time not to do it. So, Twitch and Vinegar are here, they're, uh, apparently they're the thieves that we've been we were looking for. So we got, got a boss fight in the first stage. I think it's, it's the only time that happens. So. Oh, we gotta take them out. Alright, so. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know which one is Twitch and which one is Vinegar. But. Um. Long car is gonna shoot us with uh, bullets. Um, one from high, one from low. And then one from uh, in the middle, and then short uh, short airplane is just gonna throw some bombs. And like, there is one part where if you don't kill them fast enough, they do like this. Oh, damn it! All right, well that's what happens if you fall off on a carpet. Even like during the race scene, you just bounce back up. But uh, there is one part where they combine. Oh, they're doing it right now. Cool. And then they just shoot a big ass laser. laser at the top. I got hit right there because I thought I could uh, press down and like go through the platform like you normally would, but apparently that doesn't work on the carpets. I don't know why. I'm too close. Yeah, I got hit. Yeah, I tried to do it again. I was like, why can't I like jump or like go beneath the carpets? I don't understand. It's fine. So, I mean, this, is, this is pretty much it for the fight. All right, cool. So one down. All 
and then since uh, she doesn't have another partner to swap to, she just kind of repeats the same thing over and over again. Like, once you get down to one, they just do their same whatever their attack is, so like, she shoots her three, her like, missiles, you know, or bullets in three spots. That's pretty much all she's gonna do, whatever. Because she can't switch out and uh, tag out, and then she can't combine, so there's that attack gone. Takes care of those two. Now we gotta find out who's behind these carpets. I mean, it's pretty obvious. I mean, a Twitch and Vinegar out here. And they work for the Ammo Baron. Well. So we're on the ships. Got a roast. We we don't need roast, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we never need a roast. But they're good to get. Um, so the gimmick for this stage is you can go down these uh, chutes on the ship, get to places down here. So you can open this up. Let's get this. I think it's a heart. Oh, the key. Cool. That works too. Get a gallery key. Yay! And we're just gonna climb out. So yeah, that's the gimmick for this stage. Um, well, besides like the carpet part. So. All right, we got ammo Baron men. So just get rid of those guys. It's a cannon here. Which we'll is beat the cannon. That's fine. These lasers here, insta kill. Don't walk into them. That shit right there drops men from up top. So uh, just keep moving. This one right here, we have to drop down, and uh, we're gonna go in this door. Mm. We can do this, okay. I thought this one was a, a different one. Get another key. Cool. There's a couple uh, areas in here that we just can't do yet, because we don't have either transformations or power-ups for transformations. So, that one's pretty simple. That's not the one I'm thinking of. Alright, so this one, this laser right here, can I hit that? No, I can't. Okay, so this doesn't move, or it moves very slightly. So we can't get past normally, so we have to go down the chute and then up another chute. That guy just kind of, I don't know what he was doing, he was just sitting in there. Whatever, I'm going to just run through that, because I don't care. I'm going to hit this too, I'll take the hit. Get these gems. I got to fight this one though, because I got to wait for the ship to line up. Because if I just jump right now, I'm dead. So I got to wait for the ship. Alright. Laser, and then we gotta play fucking musical chairs with the lasers and shit. I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> I forgot the last two move at the same same spot. So if you die, oh, that guy, he just he just fell right off. If you get hit by that laser, it works just like spikes. So you go to the last um, door you came out of, unless you know you didn't oh my God, come out of a door. In which case, if you didn't go into any of those doors. Um, just restart all the way back to the beginning. And then go. Alright. Alright, and we got another spot we can go down. Go down here, go on the door. Alright, now this one. This one's a pain in the ass. It took me a little bit to figure it out. But remember I talked about the crab and how this thing down here is you're, you're unkillable with this. This is the only part where you're required to use this. So we just hit down when the laser's about to show up. And we just move that. That's literally it. Alright. And we get a piece of heart for it. So It's worth it, but I mean... I'm just gonna jump into that because I'm not crabbing again to get through that, so no. not wasting that much time. Get these gems though. We'll beat this guy though. Alright. Gems? Oh, just some hearts. Alright. So now these, they don't turn off, so we have to go down. I'm gonna hit this guy. Nope, don't need to go through there. This is just money. Don't really care that much that we come through here. Gotta be getting close to the end. Yeah, this is the end right here. Because you see, the screen doesn't scroll anymore. So, just go down. We just go down. And save complete. Cool. Now we're inside the ship. And we've got to use an elephant. 
<laughs> that guy just got hit. Alright, monkey. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and hit this. Elephant again. And we can stay elephant because he's got it down in one charge, so. There is a cooldown after the elephant charge, so. That one guy that hit us, I couldn't. I was mashing charge, but you can't. Alright, so as you can see, there's spikes above us. Um, I'm gonna spider. I don't. Is this the one that I can't do yet? Let's see. No, we can do it. Right, this is just walk up and get the chest. Red gem? Red gem. I remember. There is another one. I remember which one it is. This is another one coming up that we can't do yet because we don't have a power up for one of our transformations. Ha! <laughs> uh, I forgot. I'm bad. I forgot what room this was. Lasers. Alright. And more lasers here. If you get hit by, like, say, this guy, if he, like, throws a bomb at you or something, you can use those invisibility frames and just run through the laser. Now, if I remember correctly... You can go and see this part. You can go down here. I th think th you, we can't do this yet. There's also this flower here that we can't do. Scrap metal? Scrap metal. Cool. Four out of five. But I'm pretty sure this over here we can't mess with. Yeah, we can't mess with this yet. We need... We're missing a transformation to do that, and we're missing a power-up to do that. We actually can't get that until after we get, like, the six or the uh, last transformation. So. Now this guy hits me with a thing. I mean, it didn't matter, because the laser was gone anyway. I was like, if he hits me with a thing, I can just walk through this. But, whatever. Um, so. Good. Cool. Um, anything up here? No. Alright, so just elephant. Crush this. Alright, cool. And again, you just hit these guys with one hit. Hit that guy? Oh, that guy didn't budge. I was not having it. This is the part. Whatever, you guy. Alright, so now if you're paying attention, there's a slit in the wall right to my uh, left over here. We can go in there with Monkey? We can't do that room because we don't have the power up for a transformation. We'll be back there, though. I mean, obviously, we'll be back. <laughs> Switch the monkey here so I can grab this. Uh, then we're just gonna climb our way across. That's fine. I will take that all day. All right, so this is where we need to go. Skip some stuff there, but that's fine. Get these gems. Go jump up. All right, we can't go down this, even though it's you know it says we can. But we can't go down that. And that's it. It's time for the boss. And even though I'm kind of underpowered for the boss, we're going to power through it. Because I should have uh, I should have bought the magic bracelet to cut magic cost in half. And then I probably should have got pike ball or spike ball, whatever it's called, magic. To make this boss um, easier. But it's the ammo baron. Blasted all. Air, airship costs billions of crowdfunding money. For shame, Ammo Baron. For shame. He doesn't care about the prize money. He's here for air supremacy. He wants the magical silkworm that makes those magic carpets. And make magic carpet uniforms for his men. I'll demonstrate. Men, suit up! Magic carpet uniforms. MCUs. So, I mean, that, that apparently that's how that works. You just use magic silk. And you can fly. Limited edition loudmouth. Alright, so, Ammo Baron. He's gonna summon his men around him. Um, 
We really just care about hitting him and not his men. Though you will see in a bit why I wanted uh, Obliterate Magic. That guy's just gonna spin around, I don't care. Um, Alright, there's men are gonna rain down. We can still hit him like this, I just want him to change his target. There we go. Get a couple hits in, up. And then second phase starts, and he gets two shields, which is fine. But, obliterate. There. And now, there is a third phase, where he gets three shields of men. And this is why I bought one of the uh, mega potions before. I'm gonna just take hits because the Mega Potion will fill my HP back up, so it doesn't matter. Yep, so here we uh Just Mega Potion, there we go. Two, three shields, and then we're just gonna say no, and then blow that up. Yeah, he should be dead. Yeah, so yeah, that obliterate magic makes this, um... Very... Easy? I mean, it's not even tough without the, uh, the obliterate, because I did it the first time without the obliterate. And really, you're just kind of sitting there, and, like, you kill a couple of the guys, and just sit inside his, his circle and just hit them. Just basically the same. But the obliterate, like I said, makes that a joke. What went wrong, man? I had... I had my magic. That's what went wrong, man. You didn't account for my magic beating your magic. And they carry the gown stretcher. Why do all those guys have, like, uh, pink heart uh, boxer shorts? And they all have, like, blue striped uh, socks. Weird. They also all look the same. Hm. Come on, Ammo. We have a winner. Oh, that's right, we're supposed to be in a race or something, right? Damn, I forgot. Alright, let's go. World clear. It, yeah, I won that race. Totally, that's what I was gonna do. Yeah, yeah. Win that race. Why, did you get anything for winning the race? I mean, I was all over that, man. Transformation. And we get... The mouse, mouse dance. So remember how we saw these? Nope, not that one. Gotta wait for the second one. There we go. So we saw these in uh, what do we call it? Tala uh, Tassel Town. These like little squiggly line things, and it's like, hey, we can't get over there yet. This is how we get over there. The mouse. Basically, uh, if you see one of those line. Things you uh, press the dir direction, and your mouse, the mouse will uh, go into it, and you kind of you know just maze your way through. So um, we'll be using that um, in the next part. First place, yeah, exciting. Let's see what we won. Oh, what did we win? A lifetime supply of Mermaid Falls famous canned monster chow. Oh no, we already took care of that. <laughs> right, he'll take it knock yourself out. Hey, if she's a zombie and she gets a lifetime supply, how does that work? <laughs> Alright, so we gotta find this light shard. Think you're up for the task? I mean, I guess. I mean, what if I'm not? Then what? I said I was up for the task before and you sent fucking Bolo to help me find some mermaids. Um, what are we sitting at? 170 gems? Alright, we're gonna hit these gems real quick. And, uh... Not at 200. That's annoying. You know what, I'm gonna just pop in and out of that room real quick. Or I can go in here, because I need to go over here. Heal up our magic. Oh, it's Dr. Guy. We can talk to him. Dr. Guy... Um, remember that, uh, sick we got? When we said we should take it to a doctor? Well, here, here's the doctor. Don't look so good. Want to get checked up? I sure do. Here, you can have this sick. And... Oh, 
Wouldn't that be great if sickness was just like an item? You just gave it to the doctor? Just like, hey, Doc, here's my sickness. But yeah. He gives us a lollipop. Now we actually do need this lollipop. Because we need to uh, use it to get the light shard. Remember, that's what we're, that's what we're doing. Gotta find those, that little shard. Um, I don't think there's anything else, really. Alright, so... Next part will be uh, more exploring, more stuff to do. Um, like I said, I'm going to actually I'm going to run around. Does it respawn now? No. Well, I'm gonna pop in and out and get 200 gems, and then I'm going to buy uh, one of the one of the hair upgrades. So we'll do that, and then uh, I'll see you guys next time.